Hey, happy day today. Hope you enjoyed salvation alike. I uh, hope you are accessing all that the cross has done for you. And by that, I mean stepping up and being seated in heavenly places and enjoying the benefit of all of God being all the way inside of us, enjoying his conviction, his kindness, and his nearness, all that stuff. If not, uh, just take a moment and ask yourself why. <laughs> because it generally means we're getting too distracted by something to actually apply faith and receive the full benefit of salvation. Let's go. All right, anywho, hey, quick update. Um, wanna invite you guys into this. Uh, if you've seen any of the other vids, you know, this summer, what are we consuming? How are we connecting? What are we uh, contributing to the whole? And, uh, um, you know, every Sunday afternoon, I have, or Sunday morning, I have an iPhone and it shoots me up my screen report you know, my weekly screen usage every day. And uh, so I am setting the goal as of starting today to get that down to two and a half hours a day, which I know that seems crazy that I'm on my screen for two and a half hours, um, but I'm already at like, I think it's like three and two in the afternoon and I'm already at like two and a half hours. And I'm like, holy dang, I'm gonna get discipline my heart. But the, 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 the real thing, even this morning, just getting on, checking the scores, you know, the abs, watching some highlights, just basic stuff like that. I'm really trying to cut down on my usage so that I can consciously consume heaven and engage my connection with Jesus, but also engage my connection with myself. Um, been, a, been a pretty significant month for me. Um, there's kind of some things opening up where Finding I've spent a lot of my life coping and not really being fully authentic in relationship and not actually being connected to what I am feeling, how I'm actually doing and being able to offer the authentic Austin. And, and I think I've, I'm getting convicted and it's really nothing specific. It's more just this last several weeks I've been aware that I'm trying to consume scripture and consume my thoughts with hey what is happening in heaven right now and so if you're needing some help two things that i'm doing pretty consistently and, and every time i get in the car i'm consciously trying to pray i know that sounds like kind of like crazy and spiritual like i'm like you know going into this weird intercession or whatever and, and it's not actually the case what i'm doing is really i'm just trying to focus my thoughts and my attention on jesus and ask him what he's thinking about, how he's doing, uh, what's on his heart right now. And he's just been talking to me generally about how he feels about me, my family, what's going on in the church right now, and how I can pray. And so that's one of the things I've been doing. The second thing is just every morning when I read my Bible, I'm trying to be conscious of a specific text every day. And so right now, this morning, I was reading the Sermon on the Mount, and what struck me was at the beginning of Matthew 6, where, where in the sermon that Jesus says, be careful not to do your acts of righteousness before men. And I was just thinking like, man, when I engage, when I contribute, I don't want to just throw it around and tell everyone, even throw it around the internet, but I really want to engage it where my heart posture is to be connected to Jesus. And so those are two things that I'm doing uh, in my car. It's become a sacred place to connect with Jesus. But then secondly, I'm trying to meditate on scripture every day. Um, and then I guess the third thing is I'm setting a goal of getting my screen time down to two and a half hours. And so we'll see how it goes. Uh, if you do jump in with me, if you wanna create some metrics, uh, hey, shoot me a text, drop me a comment below. Tell me what you're doing that's helping you consume things that are beneficial to you, what you're, you're connecting with and what you're contributing. Uh, I would love to be with you, be praying with you, but also if you got any screen time goals over the course of the summer, like, hey, I only wanna spend X amount of time on average per day. Uh, I would love to hear that so I could just uh, be with you. All right, peace out my dudes.